Oh man, welcome back to... Man, I need to seriously emphasize how brutal this Lemmings pack is. Because it's only the third rank and I'm already getting my butt kicked. But anyways, hey guys, praise God and welcome back to... Seblems. Anyhow, hopefully we can get through more than three levels today. We're on level 18, Hopeless Fantasies. That is a fancy schmancy exit I can see there. And we can kill free Lemmings. Oh! This is a this is a Meg said bites level. I recognize that. <laughs> Weird entrance hatch. Nice conversion of the crystal graphics. Let's see. Well, gee, we need one there, one there. Oh, they come out in different direct. Well. That shouldn't, that shouldn't be too big of a deal. I think I've got this, then. Uh, brother, are you serious? Huh. I can't really see anywhere where we could spare a platformer, though. Well, um... Hmm. This at least looks a bit more manageable than the Pac-Man level, and there's not as much going on. on a second. I see. That's pretty clever. Now they walk on the top instead of on the bottom. Okay, I can't... I was wondering if I could climb up there. Maybe I can't, though. Oh, hang on a second. Well, that just kind of works out perfectly, don't it? Oh, for real? I think this will work out just fine. Okay, this level's way easier than the last one. Oh, shoot. They're stuck there. Well, that's okay. Very simple fix.
Oh yeah, that's a cool level. Very well done, Flopsy. Very well done, Wafflem. That is pretty awesome. Woohoo! Level 19, we build castles made of slime. Oh yes, it's a slime castle tile site. And this is, I believe, Flopsy's version of the collab level we made from the slime tile set. Gee, wonder why we need the blocker. It's the Mad Professor Moriarty song. Too many lemons. That is still too many lemons. That is still too many lemons. Why is it so hard to get just two lemmings? It's always more than two. comes with him. Both of them. Okay. Darn it, why does that take both of them with him? Ugh! mine for the pillar, so I guess that's an option. Hmm... It just might be a back route.
Why do I get the feeling this is not going to go my way? Stop mining, you doofus. Uh, they're too low down to get out anyways. Well, actually, no, they're not. <sighs> Alright, let's try working backwards. We can use a downward digging scale, either the digger or the miner. Well, we do that, and then bash through all of that. They all go to happiness. A climber would really be lovely. Just one. Man, that trap is fast. Really? Both bypass? Tell me that that won't work. Uh, he definitely made it across. It's not going to work out. The difficulty curve is very inconsistent. Okay, I feel like we're gonna need the miner there, and then we can build and bash through everything here. Which means we need to perfectly time building over what we, like, destroy here and getting two lemmings exactly close together. Exactly two, so they can go for the trap. I hate levels that are all about very, 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 very precise timing. To that degree. That's... 
Yeah, but there's always going to be that one doofus who goes by with them. And we have no basher. And we would run out of builders anyways. Also, this music loop is way too short. <laughs> Not Flopsy's fault at all. That's just the way the music is. Wait a second, hang on. I had a crazy idea. If we lump them all together, could we take them all through the trap? There are not enough skills on this level. Like, I feel like there should be a climber in this skill set. Alright, ballpark. Builders does it take to get over this? Answer too many. That just doesn't work out for anybody. together. And even then, that would leave me with one, two, three. Not enough. There's just not enough stuff. I 
The only thing I'm confident in is that I'm using the builder pro or the blocker properly because there's literally nowhere else where you can use it. Leads me to conclude that we apparently need to dig under there. idea. Nobody goes for the pillar, we're all going under the pillar. There must be some giant trick that I'm missing to this level, because I literally see no possible way you could get everybody there within these skill restrictions. Well, nothing to do but try a little something new. guys. However, that is a way to get The music is driving me insane, so that's going off. The problem is, like, you can't go both ways, because if you do, you will completely run out of skills. But there's also no way you can get them up, but there's also no way you can get them all through there. New plan. Right there. Right there. No, it's still passed through. My only thought of how you could possibly do this is if you can lump everybody behind the blocker in an incredibly tight space. But I don't really see how. This is seriously the 
only way I can see things working out. And even then, it's actually no, even then it still won't work out because the blocker is going to die and we'll need two guys to get past the drips, one to carve the path ahead of time. <sighs> and this is the third rank. I feel like these should be in at least the second to last rank. Because I am completely, utterly, 100% stumped right now. I can't see any way you could possibly get to the exit. See, my only other option is, like, could we possibly save the blocker so we can do a build, block, build kind of thing? Because that's the one other way I could see you doing this, but it's kind of a problem because... Well... I think you exactly know why it's a problem. The beginning is brutal. But that's still going to waste too many builders. Actually, we can let that guy die. If it's just one guy, we can let him die. Hold on. How did another guy fall? Oh, he hit his head. Uh, the doofus. How did he get on top of the bridge? Heck no. Not happening. Nope, not even close. And again, that stupid overhang isn't even going to help either. This theme does not fit a slime castle by any stretch of the imagination. So either this pack is ridiculously difficult and I might not be able to finish it, or, wow, Flopsy, you have some wildly inappropriately difficult levels in this ranking. No, because the staircase is way steeper than the bridges would be. I was hoping we could build into the wall and then you'd build up over there, but no. No way! Okay, I can pretty much guarantee that blocker plus builder at the start is the way to go. Now, I pretty much can guarantee that we're going to need a basher to get through all this crud. We could probably, like, bash into the steel and it'll push us up. Which honestly might be a bad fade. Okay, so if I can absolutely perfectly time... A digger going through there. So exactly one other lemming will go through the tunnel in addition to the digger. And we can seal the gap over that. Then this is possible. Otherwise, I can't see any solution. And I might have to go skip ahead. I want to separate one lemming out. But again, this is not going to work. If only we could get two lemmings back. But even then, it's still not going to happen because the climber, or the digger, and the guy will go in different directions and they won't be lined up perfectly. So I need to, I need to dig in such a way that both the guy who digs and one, just one guy who falls with him, both hit the trap at the exact same time, so one will go ahead, 
And then there will be a lemming who can patch it going back up. That's the kind of puzzle I despise. What if... You do it, like, back there. If we do it at, like, the very bottom of the stairs... This is easily harder than Pimo Lems now at this point. If the third rank is this hard. I have a feeling that the Revolution rank, which is the last difficulty, won't be this hard. Like, I really don't think so. Because a level like this, I can't even rule out like a single skill to be like, oh, well, I gotta use it there, pretty much. Because there, there's really nowhere where you can use skills effectively. I have a solution. I do have one, but I, I can't get it to work because of the dumb digger. <sighs> Literally one pixel. One pixel is making the difference between me succeeding and failing here. If he just stopped digging on that one, he would... <sighs> If I can just time this perfectly. But there's really no way to time that perfectly. Because you only have so much control over the, re re the release rate. Okay. I think that's as good as I'm going to do for crowd control. I really do. I feel like I can't even make this an episode. I I refuse to make an episode where I only beat one level. At rank 3, that's, that's not happening. Uh-uh. Okay, I feel like... Maybe I'm going about this wrong. If I'm struggling this much with a rank 3 level, it must mean that there's a simple solution that I'm missing. That's got to be it. Yeah, my initial plan, the only way I could possibly see this working is use the blocker at the start, use a builder to get up there, bash through the pillar, dig through this in such a way that two lemmings go out to the right and one of them hits the trap, the other goes past, use another builder to seal the gap so all the lemmings are held there, two builders to get up there, one builder to get up there, mine through the slime, build up to this tip, bash through all that, let everybody go. But again, I don't think that's possible because of the absurdly ludicrous crowd control that that would require. Plus, the fact that you will not get two lemmings going in the same direction at the exact same time. Even with Neo Lemmix, that is too precise. You can't do that. Especially in the third rank. Maybe some people like roadblocks like this. I do not. I want to be productive in my videos and show off a lot of solutions in one video. Not one. If you think the solution is incredibly simple, Flopsy, it's not. I'm just going to say that. It is absolutely not simple. These arrows aren't fake, are they? Okay, they're not fake. I had to check, though. I suppose that's one thing we could do. We could just use a bridge to hold them back on the br on here. I feel like I'm on the right track there. You can hold them in just by using a builder, and then we could just use another builder to get them out. What if... I see. Well, this certainly changes things now, doesn't it? That saves us a destructive skill in the long run. Of course, I'm still not convinced that this is going to even work. This is the closest I've been yet, so... Let's try to make some magic happen.
I don't think we can make some magic happen because we need a builder to get up there and the basher to get through there and we only have a freaking digger. Why? Why is the level of this difficulty caliper this early on in the pack? Well, I think I will have to make a temporary break in this video so I can ask Flopsy himself or Wafflem. And how the heck you even? Because as far as I'm concerned, this level is impossible. So I will just have to get back to you guys. All right, sometime later, I finally had to consult Wafflem on this. He gave me a nice push forward and confirmed, unfortunately, what I feared to be the worst. I did have the right idea. It really is about managing the crowd unbelievably well. <sighs> but I finally at least figured it out. Good grief. I did practice this a little bit, so... You're gonna bash for there. Now we're gonna max out the release rate. This is where the crowd control comes in. There was one thing I was not quite doing right. Alright, so there are five lemmings left in the hatch. We're going to minimize the release rate again. So now there are four left in the hatch. When there are two left, we're going to max out the release rate again. So we've got one lemming, one lemming, two lemmings. So now, here's what we're going to do. What we want to do is actually... The digger is not going to fall down the hole. Instead, I, we have to dig right here as soon as he touches the stair. That one lemming that we put out, he's going to walk over it before he cuts through. He cuts through, those two lemmings fall down, and he is going to build to seal this up. And, yeah, because it's pixel perfect, they can still walk up those stairs. And now we've got five builders, the basher and the miner. So we can build up there. We'll build up there. Alright, we gotta time this miner just right as well. That's not timing it just right. It's gotta be lower than that. A little bit higher. Yep. Okay. This level was officially completely ridiculous. So, Flopsy, I'm going to give you two pieces of advice that you need to follow. One, at the very least, move this to late next rank, if not the final rank. Two, please put a different song on this level. Because I like the Professor Moriarty song, but only in very small bursts. If you put on some epic music for this level instead, I think I would have liked it a bit better. Follow those, that advice. And we but might as well finish up Revolution today. I'm going to cut most of that footage out anyways. We're on level 20 when the storm has blown over. Hey, it's Flopsy stealing my rain graphic. Nice. He didn't steal it. He asked me for it, and I gave it to him. We got to save everyone. Unfortunately, it's the sky tile set, which I do not like. Oh, fun. We have eight stackers. I always get worried if they give me more than five stackers, because it's almost impossible to make a good level that uses more than five stackers. One way field that way, this is fire. Oh, brother. We do have walkers, though. Okay. Yeah. So we need a game plan. Oh, great! And there's a hatch over there, too. No offense to Amita, Namita, but this, this, these do not look like clouds. Like, at all. 
It looks more like a gravel tile set. We'll stack there. And we'll stack there. Actually, will they even walk up into that force field? They probably will. Of course, they don't make it. You will block. You will block. Let's see. You will glide. And everybody's stuck. Cool. I guess the stackers can be useful on this level. Oh, that's gonna be stink. Do I really have to put up with gliders? I bet you we're gonna need all our platform all the platformers we can get. I guess we're going to have to glide. How far? Oh, that's a very high drop. <sighs> no bother. I'll figure that out later. Do have bashers, that's nice. music on this level. The piano is gorgeous. Oh, I already know this trick. One of my favorites. I wonder how thick is this? It's probably just enough so that way a stacker won't work. There we go. So that's that hatch saved. Cool. 
Now we're gonna do my favorite thing. Alright, let's take out that basher, because I've got a better idea. Fell. Oh, I bet I overwrote. I bet the two things happen on the same frame and it overwrote. Yeah. Yeah, that's what happened. Zoom in. Okay. This is where we stop the replay because we want to connect these bridges right here. Yep. That is not good. That hopefully will stop them from splatting. Yeah, cool. That is less cool. Alright, I really do like this level. This level is way better than the, uh, <laughs> the one I just did. Well, maybe not way better, but way more realistic for its difficulty. I did not say make him a walker twice. Alright, so they all go from... And you. Of course you. I didn't forget you. That's a problem. This will be lemming four. Lemming number one is a stacker.
Cool. Making sure everything works out for the best in the end. Cool. Okay. I have quite a few platformers left over, which is nice. That's gonna have to change. You can stack once, but you're not stacking twice. Don't tell me that overlapped with another skill assignment. This is going to get a bit tricky now. Okay, I really like what I do in that hatch. Like... I really like what I do for that hatch. Like, it, I do it very efficiently. That hatch is also pretty efficient, so... I don't think... I have to redo any of that. It's more of a question of how do I make do with what I have for this hatch. I could save a builder, that'll help. Saving builders will be useful. I mean, number one, you are out of here. I like where this is going. I do not like where that's going. So that is lemming uh, number including zero. 
so that'll be lemmy number seven. Alright, I'll let all this progress. One platform to get over there, one platform to get over there, one platform to get right over there. And use the stacker there. We probably don't need the stacker over there. So that'll be lemming number two who stacks. I can use a miner instead. That's not what you want. You know what? Screw it. We're starting from scratch. Walker there. for there. You will block. You will also mine. Because we really want the miners to survive. You will build. Our glider extraordinaire. You will block. Actually, we need to save the walker. So do it on the concrete. You will be a blocker as well, because blockers don't seem to be all that valuable, whereas stackers very much are. This. See, I am really digging this level. Oh, I better stretch those out. Keep forgetting, I have two builders to focus on. I think I'm doing much better this time. What's more important? Builders? Or platformers? I don't really see a difference. And worst case scenario, I can always change it at the end. Cool, now we just have this hatch, which should not be super bad, now that I have properly saved some skills. Yippee. 
How did you make it through there? Oh, hang on. Yes, good. Why did that guy bypass the stacker? Nobody should have been able to get past that stacker. Okay, he did it. Cool. Just in case. Oh, that was a good level. That was a great end to the rank. Well done, Flopsy. That, that, that was like everything I want in a good Lemmings level. Like, lots of cool tricks they can do. Plenty of skills, but you still have to be, like, good with them. You can't go wasting skills. Great music. You did a mighty fine job with the Sky Tile set. That, that was splendid. Doesn't quite make up for putting the last level in this rank. It doesn't. I'm sorry, but that's just the way it goes sometimes. It can be hard to predict how difficult people will find certain levels. Anywho, thank you very much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. This has been Seblems, the episode so long that I had to record it in two different recording sections. Between the next time, we'll be going to the Stormy rank. And not the Stormy rank from Pimolems. This one probably will be a good deal harder. Anywho, have a great day, and God bless.